Welcome back, little readers. November is Native American Heritage Month, and we are celebrating with one of our favorite books by Carol Lindstrom. We are water protectors. The illustrations by Michaela Goad are absolutely remarkable. In Ojibwe culture, the men are the protectors of the fire, and the women are the protectors of the water. This book encourages children to be strong and brave and to stand up for what's right. Okay, well, let's get started. Water is the first medicine, Nokomis told me. We come from water. It nourishes us inside our mother's body as it nourishes us here on Mother Earth. Water is sacred, she said. We stand with our songs and our drums. We are still here. The river's rhythm runs through my veins, runs through my people's veins. My people talk of a black snake that will destroy the land. Spoil the water, poison plants and animals, wreck everything in its path. When my people first spoke of the black snake, they foretold that it wouldn't come for many, many years. Now the black snake is here. Its venom burns the land, courses through the water, making it unfit to drink. Take courage. I must keep the black snake away from my village's water. I must rally my people together. To stand for the water, to stand for the land, to stand as one against the black snake. We stand with our songs and our drums. We are still here. It will not be easy. We fight for those who cannot fight for themselves. The winged ones, the crawling ones, the four-legged, the two-legged, the plants, trees, rivers, lakes, the earth. We are all related. Tears like waterfalls streaming down, tracks down my face, tracks down my people's faces. Water has its own spirit, Nokomis told me. Water is alive. Water remembers our ancestors who came before us, she said. We stand with our songs and our drums. We are still here. We are stewards of the earth. Our spirits have not been broken. We are water protectors. We stand. The black snake is in for the fight of its life. The end. Thank you so much for listening and reading with us. We hope you enjoyed it as much as we did. Please, please support the author by purchasing this wonderful book. And as always, be kind and keep reading. We love you so much. Have a great Native American Heritage Month. Bye.